I'm going to get into that very beautiful suit and look like the groom who's going to make his bed. Understanding, baby. I'm already wet. Ah! We trusted you. And freely opened our sisterhood to you. You're such a special type of wicked and vile human being. He's been sending videos and pictures from the shower to bloods. What are you saying? What kind of nonsense be this? What are you saying? Why well, am I not even surprised? I mean, this human being here came into our house with a gardening tool, punctured my tires, and threatened to kill us. How did we even allow this lunatic in our space? Miss Agnes, there's no need to swap insulting names. I'm sure she has an explanation. Fijiro, why did you do it? Do what? You can't be serious. <laughs> You're so desperate. I'm sure this is a, some sort of ploy. You thought when you come here, I'll be doing something inappropriate for you to use in a court, right? I may be chaotic and a troublemaker, but I am not a liar. I do not need to create to create a problem just because I'm trying to get my son. I'm a good mother, and that's an enough proof for me. Yeah, right. I just, I just imagined us in court, and I'm telling them, my lord, she came to our house with a murder weapon. I've never felt so threatened in my life. She threatened to murder us. My lord, she's, she's unstable, she's violent, and unfit to raise a child. This looks like a joke to you, right? This looks like a joke to you, right? But then, guys, come on. Why aren't you guys actually paying attention to the actual suspect? I mean, you said it yourself. She planted a camera in the house. And she's the one who's had everybody's phone the entire time. Gosh, gosh, gosh. All you do is lie. There is no redemption in you. Wasn't I the one just defending you a while ago? Defending who? A leopard rarely can change. Once a psycho, always a psycho. You know what? I think you should leave. Yeah. Leave us. I'm not going anywhere until I get my son. Do you see your son here? Have you seen him anywhere here? Did you not just get a call from your neighbor telling you that he's with Santos' stepmother? You can either walk out of here with a shred of dignity or I'll call security and have them throw you out. Choose. Where's the... I will... Shares I came with. I will... Get a dispatch rider to send it to you. Fedro, you need to leave now because whatever battle you came here to fight, you clearly are not fighting it the right way. My phone. You guys think the world revolves around your, 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 your lives and the parties and the social media and the internet that you guys are always posting. But let me tell you the truth. No one cares about your fake Barbie doll looking Madam, life that you guys are all living. Get Nonsense. out. Leave. Please. Get your hands off me. Please. Please. Piece of human waste. Um, I am so sorry to interrupt, but you need to see this. I don't have time for this rubbish. Sir, it concerns you. What the hell? <laughs> what the? So, 
No, no, you! You have skeletons in your closet too, huh? You repeat that statement one more time and wake up in the mortuary! You know, Oros, thank you so much, thank you so much. Thank you so much for this information. Now you can just give my father and I some privacy, please. No, please. No, no, go, please. Okay. Please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Drug smuggling? Really? And you have the, you have the nerve to come up on me like that for sniffing just one or two lines. One or two lines, whereas you are the manufacturer, distributor, Pablo Escobar, oh shit. Huh? <laughs> now tell me, what's so funny? What's so funny? What's so funny? Did you think I'd be apologetic? Hmm? Did you think this is your guts, your moment? There's nobody in Lagos, near Nigeria, who does not know what we'll do. How many paved roads put politicians in power and sent your thick skull to school? Dad, all your wealth is legal. Dad, I get that. It's ridiculous. Shut your disgusting, ungrateful mouth. I've never contributed one cobble to the wealth of this family. Foolish insect. All you do is work overtime to disgrace the name of this family. You haven't earned the right to ask me questions. Appreciate what we have done, add to it, or shut up! Dad, they were only children. They were innocent. And they all died. Don't you have a heart? Don't you have a conscience? Emotions have no place in business. Loss, on the other hand, is part of the manufacturing process. It is called collateral damage. Who are you? Tell me this, this weak, rubbish statement. That was why I sent you to military school. And I asked them to break you down. So that this, your disgusting weakness, will die. But at last, you are just defected. The neighbor's son. Yeah, I, I used to play ball with him. Now, you said, you said he got a scholarship to study abroad and never came back. Now, they said, they said he got sick as soon as he landed. Now, tell me, was that you? Dad! Fijiro, Fijiro, see what you have done for your life. See, see what you have done to yourself. Go to school, you say no. You want to be following man. Now you have ended up baby mama with no degree. What is your claim to fame? But I, I wasn't being shady, no. I, I'm just... What's the point in insulting her? I mean, we all have had bad days. Yeah. Some people have bad days their entire lives. Guys, we need to talk. We have spent the whole of tonight bickering, you know, throwing shade at each other, insulting each other. And we turned our sister's most memorable night into some sort of bitter, bile-filled intervention that became unkind and, and some sort of attack. 
I mean, we didn't even consider Agnes's feelings one second this night. This isn't who we are. You know, I was, I was hoping that, you know, this night would be some sort of distraction to remove me from this black hole of pain that I've been lost in. But this night has just been hurtful and triggering for me. And I do not want to spend another minute feeling like that anymore. Babe, we are all triggered. That leech came here and was live streaming our most vulnerable moment. I'm not finished, Latifa, please. You have been particularly vile and unkind tonight, Latifa. You know, Agnes didn't tell us about her attempted suicide, but you recklessly outed her. What if it was news that she wanted to keep between her and Somto? But you exposed it. Is suicide a joke to you? Look, guys, I don't mean to get all emotional and everything, but I just needed to clear the air and let you know that I am highly disappointed in you. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for triggering you, Essay. I didn't, I didn't mean to. I just thought... I'm, 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 I'm so sorry to disrupt the skimball young moment. But we all need to see this now. I'm sorry for startling you. I felt awful about how you left. What if I tell you that I believe you? Believe me about what exactly? I think that Falakia is the one live streaming the bridal shower. And there's something about her that I don't trust. Plus, you're crazy. You're kind of crazy is the garden chairs and knife in your face kind of crazy, not the espionage type. Why didn't you have the same energy when you were chasing me out of the house just now? Yeah, I needed it to look believable. Because okay. I didn't want to spook the actual rat. You know? Okay, that makes sense. So what you need to say? How about you help me expose Falakia for, for the fraud that she is? Sure, I'll do that. Just tell me what I need. Great. Okay, so first off, I need you to quit this sulk behavior. Get back in there, have a good time, eat, prepare for lunch. Uh -uh, trust me last. now, I got that one on lock. <laughs> I'll do that, trust me, that's an issue. Plus, don't forget the party pack. Oh, there's a party pack. Yes. Okay, it's all right. If I get one for lunch, it doesn't get to uh, She wasn't supposed to be here. I will take one, don't <laughs> worry. It's all right, that's fine, you can do that. Okay, so um, why don't you just head back in and um, I'll come in and support you strategically, okay? Okay, don't be long. Alright. You're trying to sleep in the box? Shouldn't you just take me all night? Atifa! How are you doing? What? 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 What are you doing? I, I saw you talking and crying to your car. What's going on? I wasn't doing anything. I'm sorry, I, I'm not I'm not usually an emotional mess, you know. I plan to put on the best bridal shower and just look at the chaos that it turned into. I guess my shares didn't suit you to your bridal shower. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> sorry, and I'm sorry about that. I didn't. Thank you, Pedro. I really appreciate it. It's nothing, you're welcome. All right, why don't you just go back in? Um, give me few minutes to calm myself down. Are you sure you're fine? Yeah. Okay, this is one. Thank you. Mm -hmm.
What do you know that you're opening your big mouth to say? I asked a direct question. I wasn't speaking Swahili. I am a businessman. Sunday's parents use their own child as a moon. I'm a philanthropist. I've changed the lives of many families who will have been destitute otherwise. The words you are looking for is congratulations and thank you. <laughs> laugh, laugh as much as you like. <laughs> but I've built a legacy for my family. I've contributed millions to the GDP of this nation. What have you done, boy? You live a privileged life off my sweat. Your choice of woman is the same thing as your taste in life. Mediocre. To think I assumed that girl had a positive influence on your life. Huh. You two deserve each other. And I love her. And she loves me. Mm. And she chose me regardless of all the demons she gave to me to live with. You're so pathetic. You are dating a junkie. He's off the internet. Yeah. I don't expect you. I don't expect you to understand. I don't expect a, a drug dealer repackaged as a philanthropist to understand what it means to love or to be loved. What a shame. You just... No, you try it. Try it. Try it and I swear, I swear I'll kill you. I'll kill you right here and right now. And yes, I'll say, I'll say you committed suicide. And yes, they'll believe that one too. They'll say you were, you were too ashamed to face the truth of our family's history coming out. You wouldn't dare. Oh, you know, you know I've been waiting for this moment my entire life. doing back here. You can't stay at this event. You're not even my darling's friend. Can you all see this? Come on, guys. I thought we just talked about showing love and kindness. She was live streaming us. Girl, you can't stay. Let's say she did. Not that I believe. But is it the worst thing in the world? She's hurting and she just wanted her son back. It's her son here, Latifa. I ask again, is her son here? If she really cares about her son, she should be out there calling lawyers, family members, and all the police, not here, puffing around like a riffraff. If anyone should say that, uh -huh. it's Essie or Agnes, not you. Because you basically get crushed too. Uh -huh. Ladies! Please, we're at it again. Sit down. Please, this, this shower is supposed to be about kindness, love, and generosity. Let's focus. It's exactly why I went after Fedro. You accused me of not being kind. But maybe I'm the honest friend in the group. Hmm? I believe as friends and as sisters, we should be able to tell each other the truth, yeah. even if it hurts. Yes, but I didn't... Wait. I'm... I am tired. I don't want to be ruined, okay? So let's just take this intervention thing and throw it in the bin. And let's get this party started again. What you say? Come on. It's, it's, sorry, come I on. just want to say something. Before we continue to party, I am very innocent. And my God will vindicate me. But I pray and I hope that the person that is behind all of all this before the sun comes out tomorrow, the person will summon us all 700 times. Mm -hmm. So, AG baby, are you ready to get married tomorrow? Hmm? Guys, I just want to say thank you, especially to you, Essie. Yeah. 
I mean, today has been some sort of reality check for me. And I assure you, Sumto and I, we are just fine. We are a red couple, but we are fine. We have our kings, but we are good. Trust me. And I am ready to get married tomorrow. <laughs> Baby girls! <laughs> <laughs> She has the gut to eat our cake. Are you allergic to cake? I'm allergic to everything cheap. And it is clear your cheap perfume <laughs> is a problem. Even if you sell everything that you have, you still won't be able to How you stop talking? It's maybe your bad breath. Smell sensitivity for on top small period. Just say you never carry belly this woman. I am on my period. Shall I show you my bloody tampon? Ew! Oh, uh, Malaki, please uh, stop being so crass. Uh, We're eating here. Ugh. Oh. Latifa, mm -hmm. can I borrow a car? I need to run an urgent errand. I'm actually very sorry. It was just bad temper. But I promise I'll I'll pay for it. At, okay. at least I'll pay for half of it, fixing it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't feel great. I feel nauseated. It might just, it just might be dangerous, cheap perfume or the food. Either way, I need to get to the pharmacy. My car is Emmanuel. Can you drive a man? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> guys, guys, oh guys, guys, guys. Do you remember that guy that was seriously hitting on Latifa? Which one? Okay. The one that the guy that dresses like Michael Jackson is <laughs> jumpy. <people. laughs> Lately. You are laughing. <laughs> Why well, should I? It's a big deal in LA. Sounds he started a tech company and he sold it for millions of dollars. You are mm -hmm. Millions in dollars. Whoa, 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 whoa. See, that's him. Ooh. See, buddy. Mm. Mm. See, baby. <laughs> You should actually damn this guy. God yeah. forbid, God forbid. I am not married. Are you not married? I am not desperate, yes. <laughs> you are not. Oh, Please, I have a question. Please, what is Somto's most embarrassing moment? Um, excuse me, guys. But something just. Be nice. Can't. I don't want to Hmm. 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 Anyway. Mm. There was this gist that Sumto gave me about some date, some tacky date he had. Mm -hmm. So he was with this girl and he was trying to text this guy now. You know how guys used to do their things? Mm -hmm. And then he now sends the guy to text, telling the guy that, Ooh. Um, the girl was tacky, um, she had a bad breath, mm -hmm. she, 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 she probably hadn't showered the entire day, uh -huh. and... Mr. Kelly sent it to the girl. <laughs> that was how this girl actually poured a drink that she was drinking. Well deserved. Well deserved. That's, yeah, that's the most generic story he tells everyone. That's not his actual most embarrassing moment. Madam, I know your boo much more than you do. Can you give me your own? <laughs> it's the tattoo he has on his bum. So he lost a bet he had with his roommates in, while in uni, and then the dare was that he was supposed to draw the tattoo. <laughs> now the worst thing, was even worse than the tattoo, was the actual, he, like, he tried to do a laser surgery to take the tattoo. <laughs> He has the outline of the ugly butterfly. He has so much on his bum bum. 